Um, okay. And since we already talked about Cassie, we could start talking about her, I guess. Um, okay, so the writing for her was fine. Um, I didn't think it was as strong as it was in the previous movies as far as the 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 father daughter connection that I re- really liked from the first two movies. I didn't feel like it was as strong as it was in this movie. And I think it's mainly because I don't I didn't like this actress that they got for Cassie. I I didn't I didn't really like her that much. Um I don't know why they recasted her from um, Endgame. Like, I guess because they think they, they need a little bit, they needed a more established actress to 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 play this character for this movie. I guess I don't know what the reason was, but I didn't think it was a good reason. So they cast they they recasted Cassie three times. Um, after watching this. I wish they kept the the actress in the middle right there. You know, you you, you guys saw her in any game. Um I wish they kept her because uh let me let me look up the actress's name real quick. Um sorry, became ill I'm ill prepared about this. Um but yeah, this this new actress they got for Cassie, I did not I did not care for her. Um I thought her performance was Catherine Newton. Okay. So I know I saw her in other things where she was better, but for some reason, like I just felt like her performance was dry in this movie. It it honestly was. Like I didn't feel like she emoted enough where the scripts called for her to emote. Some of the some of the more touching scenes that she has with Scott, it kind of didn't really hit as well because like Lily, her her expression the entire movie was this. That was her emotion throughout the entire movie. She did not change at all. Like, at least with um, the the actress here in the middle, like when when she um reunited with Scott in Endgame, you saw the emotion on her face. Like, like you felt you felt it was you know the performance that she was she gave in Endgame. It was very tear jerking. Like. I felt more emotion from her than I did with Catherine Newton. I did not understand why they recasted her. They really shouldn't have done that. Um, so that kind of that kind of played to the fact that I didn't like Cassie as much in this that I did with the previous movies. Um, I yeah, and on top of that, I just felt like the writing for her was kind of kind of basic you know like prodigy daughter that becomes a genius and she's a rebel and how many times we're going to see that rebel storyline in a marvel project like we already saw this with kate bishop in hawkeye like it's just so cliche at this point like i just didn't feel like there was anything that unique about her character this time around it was very disappointing because scott and cassie's dynamic as i said is one of my favorite um it's one of my favorite parts of the Ant-Man movies. And like for this to not be as good, it was very disappointing to me. Um, let's see. There was no problem with the actress with Endgame. They should have kept her. Yep, I agree. I absolutely agree. I, I, did, I did not understand why they recasted her, but they did. Oh, well. Um, but not to say that did I think that she was awful? Did I think Catherine Newton was awful? No. She was average, serviceable at best. Once again, just didn't capture the magic like they did in the previous movies. 